Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Dell XPS 15. Now you can pick this one up on Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on this one, 2,000 bucks. Now this is a special request video. I've been getting a lot of comments from students going back to school asking me which laptop would I recommend, including my daughter and her friends. Now if you watch my channel, you've seen the MacBook, you've seen the Razer Blade and the HP Omen, all of the different gaming laptops, you've seen the Chromebook, you've seen all of the Samsung 2M1s, and you've seen my personal favorite, the Surface Book 3. But when it comes to going back to school, this is the laptop that I recommend. This is an all-around beast. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. Like I said, the price on this one, 2,000 bucks. Now for the display, you got a 15.6 inch touchscreen 4K UHD panel with a resolution of 3840 by 2160. That has 500 nits brightness and it has Gorilla Glass 6 for protection. For the processor, you got the 9th gen Intel Core i7. Now you got 16 gigs of LP DDR4 RAM, 512 gigs of storage, the graphics card is the NVIDIA GeForce 1650. Now it's running Windows 10 Pro. The battery life is rated at 86 watt hours. You got quad stereo speakers, a 720 HD camera, and a fingerprint sensor. Now on a side note, there's a newer version. All right, if you get the newer version, that one is gonna have the 10th gen Intel Core i7 with the NVIDIA GeForce 1650 Ti graphics card. But listen closely, I recommend getting this one. All right, this one has all of the ports. Now, if you get the newer version, all you're gonna have is Thunderbolt 3. With this one, you got USB-A and you got HDMI. Now, I'm gonna show you how important that is in a second. All right, so let's unbox this and see what it is. First things first, shout out to White Shoes, back in the building. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. White shoes. I love my white shoes. Calm down. Okay, now I've been using this for about two weeks straight. And I can tell you from first-hand experience, this is a certified beast. Gaming, video editing, doing all your schoolwork, you're not gonna have a problem, not to mention the display is immaculate. Now my personal favorite is the Surface Book 3, but this one is all around better. All right, it's more, it's more powerful and it's a better deal. Okay, now inside the box, simple presentation. This is gonna be your Dell laptop. All right, let's get this out of here. Got your usual books and shit, plug them and follow them. And it does come with a power cable. Now, one of the dope things about the power cable, check this out. The end of the power cable has a little light on it. Why is that important? If you have a nice desktop setup and you got cables all over the place, when you go underneath your desk, there's only gonna be one light up cable. So you're always gonna find this. I, I am feeling that. Okay, so here we go. Dell X, uh, XPS 15. Let me do the smell test on this one. Mm! This one smells like the first day of school. All right, now with the coronavirus out here, your first day of school, you might be wearing your underwear, so you don't gotta worry about nobody taking your lunch money, but it is what it is, all right? The build quality on this is A1. Check this out. All brushed aluminum. Got your Dell logo. On one side, you got a full-size SD card slot. Now, this is what I was talking about, the ports. You got a full-size USB-A. Here's your battery indicator. All right, you tap that once, shows you how much battery you have. There's your lock. Now, you'll see the battery indicator lights once I power it up. On the other side, here's your plug input. You got another full-size USB-A, HDMI. You got USB Type-C and a headphone jack. Now on the bottom, got two rubber stoppers that go the length of the key, uh, <laughs> the base of the uh, laptop. That's gonna keep it from moving around. You can actually change the battery if you want. Got some ventilation on the back. Now watch this. This is one of the best things about this laptop that caught me off guard when I first got it. When you open it up, look at this carbon fiber trim. All right, this is carbon fiber composite. If you look closely, it does look like that carbon fiber. It has a soft matte feel to it. You're gonna love resting your fingers on this. Your hands and your fingers, <laughs> all right? Let's power this up. Now I will say this, there's only one thing about this that's missing, no Windows 10 hello. But you do have a fingerprint sensor. 
Okay, so I'm gonna let this power up. Now this has been completely off. Let's see how long it takes to go from off to completely on. Okay, get that into focus right there. Okay, there it is. Completely off to completely on. Let's use that fingerprint sensor. And there it is. The build quality is immaculate. Not to mention 4K display. All right, now that's one of the things that I love about this one as opposed to my Surface Book, 4K touchscreen display. Now I would recommend the Surface Book if you're a student that likes to take handwritten notes, there's nothing better than using a Surface Book with the Surface Pen. But like I said, as an all around beast, this is a better buy. All right, let's set this up. All right, so first, let's do the one hand open test. Now you will get a little liftage off the table, but you can open this with one hand with no problems. Let's do one more. Little liftage, little droppage, but you're good to go. All right, next I'm gonna open this up in complete darkness so you can see the backlit keys. All right, so here's the one hand test. Okay, just opened up. Let me use my fingerprint. Okay, there it is. Now, here's the backlit keys. Nice and bright, and you also have two different settings. So that's 50%, and that's off. Max brightness. No problems typing in complete darkness. Now let's take a look at the keyboard, and I can't stress this enough, you're gonna love this build quality. The soft carbon fiber trim, I right, so when you rest in your palms on it, the keys are soft and clicky, excellent key travel. You got all your shortcuts, got your fingerprint sensor, big trackpad, nice and clicky, definitely easy to use. All right, now as far as the webcam, 720p video. Now I was on a conference call with one of my brothers from Saudi Arabia, and this is what it looks like. Now of course, I'm gonna mute out the sound, but basically you get the idea. All right, so now let's take a look at this beautiful touchscreen 4K display. Add a new window. Let's go to our YouTube. Let's pull up a video. Let's see, do I have anything on cue? Okay, there it is. Let's do our flossy Sony, why not? My usual test video. Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your okay. boy Floss. Now let's get full Thank screen. You know, another video. And today we're going to be testing out the new Sony A6400. Now I'm out here with Sony in beautiful Look at California. This. Testing out this new camera. Now, like I said, for 2019, now let's take a look at the speakers. Let's get out the house, get on the road. So now we're on the road. Let's check this out. Now, here we go. Oh, this display is beautiful. To me, that's why this is killing the Surface Book 3, this 4K display. The speakers actually sound pretty good. For a laptop this size, I'm impressed. Now, what about editing videos? This thing is a beast. And on a side note, I actually edited my Panasonic video right from this laptop. Okay, so let's open up Vegas Pro. Now this is my full editing software. Let's go to, uh, let's open up a video. And this is how it's gonna look. Yo, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Floss. Back again with another video. Now watch this. Look at the rendering speed on this. We'll do this one as uh, some random letters. Look at the rendering speed. This is excellent. 
This is twice as fast as my HP Omen X. All right, now after a hard day of cheating in school, what about gaming? This is where the ports come into play. So you're gonna grab one of these, we'll just plug it into the side, grab a controller, and let's do some gaming. Let's open up Killer Instinct. And this is the full game. Look at the loading speeds. Now let me dim the light so y'all can get the full effect. All right, now whenever I play video games, I like to use a Bluetooth speaker. So let's get this. Okay, we'll try the usual. Let's do uh General General. Okay, here we go. Now I'm a little bit rusty, see so I gotta bear with it. Nah, bro. Let's go. Nope. I got him. Ah, oh, drop it. Let's go. All right, I gotta warm up, y'all. I gotta warm up. from your schoolwork, get some gaming on. Now, as far as battery life, keep in mind this is a 4K display. So if you want longer lasting battery, you're gonna have to tweak the settings. 
but I use this at max brightness, max performance, max everything for a full gaming session, and I got over five hours. So this will easily last you a full day of work or a full day of school. All right, so overall, on a scale of one to 10, the Dell XPS 15 is a major, major, major go. If you're a student and you're looking for a Windows laptop, this is it. You can do all your schoolwork, you can edit all your videos, and you can also game on this with a beautiful 4K touchscreen display, carbon fiber trim, long lasting battery, and great sounding speakers. Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I'll see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and pitch and be rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spot one to beam up. Energize. Everybody in the world uses technology. And if you're gonna buy some of that technology, you gotta understand certain things. Subscribe to Flossy Carter. He does reviews of all the latest technology. The iPhones, the iPads, the Galaxies, the Samsungs, whatever the fuck. The Beats by that doctor guy. And he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at. You know, I'm an animal lover, so I like that shit. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flossy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.